And this is just a quick little video to show uh, one of my favorite pet battle bloggers who finally decided to make a YouTube channel about three months ago. I missed it because I only check his blog like every couple of months and I don't really check the daily part and then I saw that he started doing YouTube videos and I got so excited because I always thought like oh it would be great if this guy did YouTube videos because uh, he has lots of good teams. He runs the site pvppetbattles.com great name for the site actually and that's probably how I found him in the first place was because it, it it's pretty much the first thing that comes up if you type out PvP pet battles. Uh, he has lots of lots of teams. I think I've copied some of the names for them. <coughs> if I didn't just straight up copy the whole team itself. Uh, he has way more knowledge about pet battles than I do. He's been doing this since like beginning of Mist, I think when it came out. I didn't start till the last till later Mist. And I've been following him ever since then, so like over a year now, I think. Uh, yeah, so you got the Disco Battles. He has the tier list. His list is a little bit different than mine. The high tier list, or whatever. First tier, second tier, Bone Serpent, Fragment of Anger, Graves, MPD, Merkelot, Ore Eater, Terra Claw, Hatchling. Uh, I agree with all of those except the Bone Serpent. Bone Serpent's good, but I don't really think it's that good. Second tier, yeah, he does his tier thing a little bit differently than I do. Uh, the whole tier thing is arbitrary anyway, I just give him random values, so <clears throat> obviously it's gonna be different from mine. But hey, he started up PvP pet battle videos. Uh, the way he does it is he just I don't know, his videos are kind of similar to mine, so that's great. He also has some good knowledge, and his commentary is pretty good. So I totally recommend you check him out, because there's just not enough... Ooh, look, he subscribed to me late, recently. There's not enough uh, people who do pet battles uh, consistently. I mean, there is Warcraft pet battles, too, but he does a video, like, once a month or something. Uh, <coughs> this guy's not terribly consistent either, but still, it's he's like one of my favorite pet battle bloggers. He used to be a lot more active back in the day, but I'm surprised he actually started making up a YouTube channel, so I thought I would just make a video to show that he's made his own YouTube channel and you should totally go check it out because he totally knows what he's doing and he has a crap ton of pets and I expect nothing but great things from his channel.